All right. Another drive reporting from Tesla FSD 12.6.4. Taking my hat off. Um, so this is our first drive on 12.6.4. Not too long ago for me, I received 12.6.3. So we will check out and see if there's anything new. Hopefully uh, no regressions and go from there. So <clears throat> first things first, our first left turn, smooth as butter. So no issues there. Gonna keep that positive momentum going from 12.6.3. Uh, um, so far so good. It is uh, later in the afternoon, so we'll come up on some more um, pockets of traffic. Nothing too crazy, but we'll probably see some, some pockets of traffic, some potential school zones, things like that. So we'll definitely monitor that. Again, our speed relative to the flow of traffic right on par so no issues there one of my major pluses from 12.6.3 was just the turning overall the smoothness of the turning and so definitely looking forward to uh, the continuity of 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 that piece along with any new updates here from 12.6.4 um reading the notes Nothing uh, really stood out to me as far as differences in this build in the last. So when that happens, everybody, when we don't see any differences in language, we got to test it out. Okay, so here we go. Coming up on our infamous turn here that person's going right no problems we're going left and not too bad uh that's always a funny turn just because you're going through a uh island but what i will say is that it has been handled better on 12.6.3 there was like no jerkiness whatsoever it's a little bit of jerkiness on that turn, but nothing, nothing too bad. Nothing where I'd call it a full blown regression. So we'll uh, monitor that for the time being. And going through this intersection, so far so good. There was some construction here coming up to the right. It looks like. It's not blocking this lane, so we'll be okay with that. Okay. Coming up on our light here, major intersection. No issues there. It's a far cry from last week for those that are in the DFW area. Last Wednesday, it, with, with the, the wind chill, it was negative five, negative six. And now it is 80 degrees. So. Just like that, we are uh, coming into spring here. Definitely looking forward to it. All right, back at it here. Again, going through this four, four way intersection, major intersection here. Just made that light, thank goodness. Okay. 
So this is a better time of the day to drive. The, the sun is beginning to come down, but not so much so to where it's blinding. So that's good. We are coming into, you know, three, four o'clock range. So we will see an uptick in traffic. So we'll, we'll certainly watch for lane changes with this new build, if it handles those changes assertively like it has in the past. One call out for me for sure is if it's inadvertently changing lanes just because for the heck of it. That happened in one of the previous videos not too long ago. Prior to that, it, it, it hadn't happened in, in several months. So I was uh, surprised to see that that one unique instance. What I would say with that, it was in an area that I typically don't drive in. So always trying to correlate uh, typical issues that I, I see in my area versus other areas and, you know, potentially put things together there. But nevertheless, so far so good. Passing a, uh, a 90. There are a lot of uh, older, older, it's funny to say older, X's on the road. Um, that's also good at the same time. I know as of today, uh, news has come out that the model SNX refresh will be coming uh, potentially near the end of this year. So uh, it's exciting for folks that are looking to upgrade myself, not quite yet. So I will still be bringing the hardware three content for uh, for the foreseeable future. That should be exciting for sure. So definitely on the lookout for that. Uh, we had one lane change earlier. Looked good. No issues there. Typically in hurry mode, we'll make more lane changes than normal just to get to the destination a little bit quicker. So what hurry mode shouldn't do is compromise safety or personal preference. So for those out there that are new, if hurry mode is, is, is too quick for your liking, definitely knock it down a notch. Standard is there's no issues there. I just don't choose to be in standard mode. It's not my preferred driving style and chill. Unless, uh, you know, a resounding amount of people request for me to drive and chill. I'm not doing not doing that. That's not uh, that's not me. So there you have it uh, again. We have a green light coming up, it's just more traffic than usual. So real methodical in approach. We are doing a great job. It's at lane centering, staying within the, the lines. They make this light, but that's OK. Fast forward this up a bit. All right. That wasn't too too bad. So back at it here. Again, this is this is probably going to be the majority of individuals that are utilizing FSD, especially if you travel for work. This will be more than likely your scenarios. Decent amount of traffic on the street, decent to heavy amount of traffic on the street and honestly looking for something that will um, 
methodically take you from point A to point B, right? Um, so this is what's going on now. Speed limit is 45, we're doing 47, which is perfect. No issues on my end with that. This is this is right where we want to be at. Making this left uh, lane change here as our destination is going to be coming up pretty soon. We'll be making a uh, protected left, I believe. Actually, I don't believe there's a light. Um, looking good so far. Oh, I did that. There's a light. Okay, good. So we did. We did take a little bit to uh, come to speed, which, again, I don't have an issue with just because I see why. Um, turn was coming up sooner than later there, so no issues with that. Got a flashing yellow light here. Traffic is about to end, and we'll make this turn. Followed by an immediate right. All right. Coming into this structure here. Have another X with the door up. Okay, yo. So um i will take over here trying to park um so yeah that's that's about it um first drive 12.6.4 um really no issues on on my end with that um no critical disengagements anything like that so looking good uh i'll be sure to take a couple more drives give my thoughts and feedback continue to like comment subscribe um and until next time Appreciate it.